<laughs> guys, guys, please stop. It is not catching up. Give me a chance. Right guys, welcome and today I am going to be talking about things we have all done in school. Okay, so number one, in assemblies, um, you always have to stand up to do a song or like some churchy hymn or something like that in an assembly and you'd always end up either doing this with your mates like <laughs> dig it or Really good. I've got into that too much. Number two, here we go. Absolutely whacking the person you hated on the head during a heated game of Duck Duck Goose. I know I did that, but I didn't actually play Duck Duck Goose in school. I played it in like Cubs. Cubs is like a, I suppose in America you get like army camps and stuff like that. And uh, well, our, ours was kind of Cubs in, in, in that way. Yeah, it was uh, very interesting because. As this guy I hated, he was like really freckly and really ugly. I didn't even know I hated him, he did nothing wrong to me. And I remember going around the thing, like that, tapping everyone's head. And then I, I think I just like fucking roundhoused him, seriously. I knocked him out. Number three. Using your pencil case to cover your answers in your spelling test because all of your classmates were cheating six year old bastards. That's, that's, that's very true. Look at that shadow. That's very true though guys, that is very true. I either used to, because they always, they always, for me, they always used to give me a sheet of spellings, like 10 spellings on them. I just used to cut the little bit out, put it under my book, and each time the spelling came out, I just used to drag it out one more. Like that, so each time the new spelling came out, I was like, yep. Because, yep. Train, yep. Spelling bastard, yep. Cheating bastard, <laughs> like that. Number four, sitting on the benches in assembly in year six, looking down at all the younger peasants and thinking I started at reception now we're here <laughs> my most embarrassing moment in school this is really weird I was like yeah probably, you're probably year six actually this is how mature I was so someone left a shit in the bottom of the toilet and I decided to get the toilet plunger pick it up and smear it all over the, all over the wall Ooh. You're hard. Why, why would I do that? Like, what is even going through my thick skull? It's like this guy just comes up and smears shit over the walls. Good one. I didn't actually sing this in school, but let me get, like again, I said, sung it in Cubs. He's got the whole wide world in his hands. He's got the whole world in his hands. That song with, the, with God and everything. It's like, oh. Um, I'm not religious at all in any way, shape or form. In fact, I actually strongly believe there's nothing out there. Singing, he's got the whole wide world in his pants, not hands, in the assembly because you were a comical genius who couldn't be controlled. Number six, being sat to the wall at playtime and having to watch all your friends, having to watch all your friends play whilst you stood and lost all your dignity. Well, in our school, there was this thing called a French friendship stop. Uh, literally a lollipop stick, but it had friendship on it. And you were in to sit there if you had no friends. Like, why? If they've got no friends, they don't want every fucking person in the school to know about it. But everyone, all the teachers thought it would be a great idea to, like, make a friendship stop. So if anyone had no friends, sit there, and then some nice guy would come over walk and say, Oh, that's alright, come and join our group, fuck off. Number seven. Unsticking yourself when nobody was looking whilst playing stuck in the mud because you were too sassy and lived life in the fast lane. Hmm. Uh, but you wouldn't even, you'd do it when everyone was looking, you wouldn't even give a shot. You'd be like... <sighs> you know what, I don't have fucking time for this. I want to play. Number eight for you lovely people. Spending the whole of your primary school life trying to get your goony alien pregnant. Okay, that is one thing I have to admit to. So, you know these little like, pocket aliens that came in a little skull, like that, yeah, um, they, they used to, like, they're like really gooey and disgusting, the gooey aliens, and um, it kind of, no, it never once worked, never once worked. Watching Art Attack after school and thinking that anything was possible as 
long as you had some PVA glue. Yes, my life was great. But I always used to run around the house finding like spare toilet roll, like the, the grey bit of the toilet roll, and then uh, like a cereal box, and then a shoe box, and then PVA glue, salad seat, scissors. I get it all together and realise I missed the fundamental part. The instructions and the brain. I didn't have either of those. Okay, number 10 is the, this is one I've made up. And it's actually quite true. You had your squad, typical year six squad, and there's always one guy. And I was it. I, well, I, I'm still am. But there was always this one fat kid, right, that thinks he's hard. He thinks he's like the bounce of the group. And then whenever there's like a year five football game or something, like they, like in our school they always had just one set of goals and they're pretty good goals like samba decent like pop-up ones like quite big and the year fives were on one day we were finishing our sats and we came off after the last last sats exam and we went on the field to play the last bit of football and um me being the fat bouncer lad all right decided to um just literally pick up the goal with like one hand it was quite a big goal as well. it was like the size of my windows and um yeah, I just literally just went. There we go, boys. And then went to the next one. There we go. So there's always this one kid, i.e., me, that thought he was the body dicks bollocks of the school. Thank you very much for watching, guys, as you always do, and as you always do perfectly. If you want to watch any of these two videos, then make sure you hit them, click them, not hit them, that'll break your screen. Uh, hit the subscribe button as well for more of the sickest content on the internet and channel. Um, and also, thank you very much for 4K so I've done pretty thick and pretty decent. Not so why? <laughs> that was really. Oh. Yeah. Have fun, guys. Bye.